girls and guys, it is Sarah from Style Let's Play, and we are back with another episode of Minecraft Pocket Edition. And right now, we are in the Mesa biome because I was collecting some dark brown clay as well as some sand because there's a desert nearby. So that's what I've been doing. We're just going to grab a bit more clay, and then I think we're going to make our way back to my house. I don't think I need anything else. Let me have a quick look around and check because today we are going to be working on a tree farm. I want to start working on the bridge from our house up to the science lab, but uh, whoa, look at the sky. What the heck is going on? That was scary. Um, but yes, because I'm going to need so much wood, I was like, we need to get a tree farm going first. So once we get the tree farm going, then we could start building our amazing bridge that I have in mind. Um, I, like I said, I don't think we need anything else. So I'm pretty sure of it. So I will cut back in when I've made it back home. All right, so we are home now. I was looking for my bed, but I have no idea where that is. So I might just have to make a new one because I don't want to risk dying because that would not be very good, would it? So let's see. Do we have extra wool? Do we have any weird colors that we could combine? We only have three pieces of wool anyway. Oh my gosh. And then we need three pieces of wood as well. There we go. And now we should be able to make our bed. Oh my gosh, there's a zombie trying to get into my house. This is not good. I don't even have a sword on me besides this one here. Let's kill you. I need to kill you in order for me to sleep. So get out. Get out of my house. You are not welcome in here, buddy. Get out. There we go. We did it. All right, now go to sleep. Come on. Whew. What a long day. All right, so we should be good now. So what we are going to need for our tree farm, we're going to need some fences because we're going to use that to light up the place. So we want to take all of these here. We're going to make like little lanterns, which are going to look awesome. You just wait and see. So we're going to need some of those. We've got our clay and we might need an extra shovel if we have one. Uh, we don't have one, but I think we should be good with what we have. Should be, but it's a big should. I'm not exactly 100% sure. <laughs> Let's close that door. All right, so we can head back now, and we're going to be making the tree farm over on this side here. And it's going to be off to the side, nowhere near the house. It should look very, very nice and very, very good. So what we're going to be doing is the first thing I want to do with the tree farm is make the ground for where it's going to be. And then afterwards, we might do an exterior. So what I was going to do and the reason why I had gotten all the sand is because I was going to build a tree farm and then outside it was going to be made out of glass with like wood blocks going across like creating an archway so just imagine like piggy move out the way i'm trying to show the people one example and then imagine the building being like this with like a wood block going around of course it looks weird like this because it's they're the same size that's what i was thinking but I'm not 100% sure yet. It might look more nature, nature-y if I just leave it without it being in a building. Which kind of thing's weird to have a tree farm in a building anyway. So what we're going to do is we're going to keep the grass that's already here, like the dirt block here. And we're going to be terraforming basically. So we're going to be adding some brown stained clay like so and then we're gonna mix in some of our you know dirt paths and that's gonna basically be this whole entire area around here and you it's, it's it has to be a mixture of a lot of different combinations of like the grass and the brown and stuff so first we're gonna go ahead and do the shovel first because that's the easiest to do and then we're gonna go in and replace the dirt as well so Put that there, just like that. And our shovel should be breaking. There it goes. And then now, 
it still looks a bit strange because there's not enough of a variation just yet and then we're going to be replacing it like so and for the lighting we're going to have let's get our fences in our hand and our torches and what i might do if this is take ends up taking too long is i might show you guys just the start of it and then show you guys the end results because it could be quite tedious to do this so right now you can see there's not much going on right now. I need to get another shovel though because I need to dig out the dirt and stuff. And we're also going to try to see if we have any saplings. We could start planting those. And we want enough space in between each tree. We don't want it to be, you know, too cramped or anything like that. We don't want straight lines either because then that looks too organized and, and too, I want it to look more natural. So let's look in here. So, oh, we actually do have oak saplings, which are good. We need those. Is that all we have as far as saplings? What the heck have I done with all my saplings? Is that they're like disappeared? Let's put this stuff in here for now because we don't need it. We actually do need that. We don't need that. Um, I can't believe that's all the saplings we have. I am flabbergasted. So let's take those. And I actually needed those sticks, but we'll leave it for now. Um, I really need to put item frames on these because I keep forgetting what goes where. So we need two of those. Where's my wood? Oh, is it this? This one here. There we go. And I need my crafting table. So we need to make, let's make an iron one because it'll last us a lot longer. And then we'll make two stone ones as well, just in case. So take that. Perfect. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Also, I want to show you guys what it's going to look like when everything is all done. Like when when um, the trees are actually fully grown and stuff. Because it looks very different when it's just saplings and they're actually grown. We have spruce wood there. We have savannah trees. All we're going to be missing is um, dark oak and jungle wood so we could always add those in later so it's not that big of a deal so we're gonna go around just digging randomly because this is where the dark clay the dark brown clay is gonna go so we just want to go ahead and pick different spots to do this and i would like to add just dirt like this but the only way to do that if it's it's being surrounded by something else so the grass doesn't grow on it so you don't want to have huge spaces with grass. You don't want to leave any area that has too much grass grow, grow, growing on it and stuff. So um, let's see how this is going to look. And then we'll start putting in the saplings. It's a shame we don't have bone meal to make the whole process go a lot quicker. So it's just going to be a waiting game. And there we go. Put Jump out of there. There we go. Boop, 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 boop. Boop, boop. Oh, do you don't want to place there? No, you don't want to? No. Oh, yeah, there you go. A little bit of a delay there. Just a tiny bit. And we've got one here. And here. Oh, we've got two more here. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. I thought I ran out. I was like, no. Please don't tell me I ran out. I always made sure I had enough. There we go. Look at little Sheepy. I think he wants to be Sheepy Jr. There we go. It's looking mighty good. So now we've got to put the torches on top of there. So let me go ahead, plant the oak so that you guys could see it. And then I'll wait for it to grow and show you guys what it looks like. All right, guys. So the tree farm is already finished. I just need to go ahead and add uh, the other different type of trees so right now i'm cutting down the spruce hoping that i get some saplings from this i picked up the dark oak ones but i remember when dark oak first came out you could still grow one by itself but now you do need four which means i'm gonna have to make my way back there to try to get two more but that's a really really long and far journey so i'm not gonna do that anytime soon and anyway we don't really need dark oak for the bridge that i'm planning so it should be all right for now um but when i get the chance i'll definitely make my way back there so let's check and see if I've gotten any. It doesn't look like it unless I picked it up and I didn't notice. Ah, yes. I have one. 
I've got one out of all of this tree. Go oh, oh, there's another one. Oh, yes. Thank you for that. So let's see if we can get any more. Punch these tree leaves. Please give me some more. I need it. We're also going to need to get the savannah. <gasps> I forgot about that. Let's make our way up that little hill and get some of the acacia wood. Oh, and birch. Oh my gosh, I forgot all the different... How did I forget birch? Birch. It used to be my favorite, like, block to build with when it first came out. And I, for I forgot all about you, birch. I'm sorry. I never meant to disrespect you like that. No, no, no. We don't need a lot of birch, though, because now I, I hardly build with it. So it's mostly just spruce uh, and oak that I need. So we're going to have to extend that tree farm out a lot more. But it's basically going to be the same concept of terraforming the land around it and stuff. Putting little torches around with the fences. Just that kind of stuff, just to add a little pizzazz to it. Are you not going to give me any, um, exactly? You don't, you don't want to? Okay, Birch. Be rude then. Be rude. How are they not giving me any? I, I need, I need you. I need all the saplings in the world and I'm getting none right now. Is there, yeah, yeah, there's another one right here. Look, this one looks a lot nicer. Let's go ahead and, uh, just punch the leaves ourselves. Come on, Birchy Birch. No? Really, Birch? Really? That is not nice of you. Who knew getting saplings could be so difficult? So we've got spruce, we've got the dark oak. We're gonna end up having so much wood after this from just trying to get saplings. Did the other one drop any at all? Let's go check the one down here. Maybe it's dropped a couple. <gasps> it did! It did! Yes! Thank you, almighty tree. I appreciate you. Wait, where did it go? I saw it! I know what I saw! Oh, there it is. Is that- Yes! Come on down here. Come on! Oh, there's two of them! Yay! Okay, let's put that right over here. And then we're going to need to get rid of the string. Because we're going to need to make room for the acacia wood. There we go. Put the spruce back in my hands. So we've got two spruce, two birch. And we just need to get two acacia really. Ooh, there's a little moo We need to start, like, expanding our animal farms. Ooh, there's more here. Excellent, excellent. So now, over to the mountains we go to that side. Please don't fall and hurt yourself. You didn't follow the rules. Look at these. That's the tree farm there. Don't worry. It's gonna look a lot better. We've got all kinds of trees there. Looking magnificent is what we do. Oh, there's one there. I don't have to climb the, the mountains. Yes! How did I forget there was acacia trees there where that's literally my spawn- Hey, 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 give me that back. Yeah, trying to steal my birch tree saplings. This is my spawn point, and I forgot that there were thingies there. Genius. Genius, genius, genius. I get a genius point. Okay, let's see. Will you be nice and give me um, a sapling straight away, Savannah? Hmm? I'm trying to get the top of the tree first. Look, we're not going to have any room. Okay, so we've got that one going. Let's chop this one down as well. And see which one's gonna give us a sapling first. This sh this should be a mini game. Who could get a sapling first? It's the greatest mini game in the world. I uh, know, I uh, know. Hi Pixel, if you want to contact me for for the rights to my mini game, let me know. <laughs> no, just kidding. Let's see. Anything? 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 <gasps> I see one. Yay! Okay. Uh, what if we gonna, we'll get rid of this one single piece of cobblestone that we have? Hey, 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 Go away, cobblestone. We don't want you anymore. I'm sorry. May you rest in peace, cobblestone. There. We've got it. No, no, no. Give that back. We've got two now. Good. Good, good, good. Okay, that's enough. Now let's head on back 
and place these down before something like happens and they disappear and stuff. And also, if you guys are watching this on Halloween, I know I keep saying it and I must sound like your parent by now. But I hope you guys have a nice, fun, safe Halloween. Please be cautious. And if you've already gone trick-or-treating, did you get a lot of candy? Did you like it? What did you dress up as? Let me know in the comments down below. All right, so what I ended up doing for the trace to kind of keep them in line, but not really, is I kept a three block space in between them. And then I basically did like boop, 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 and a zigzag. And then I just put the other two behind it randomly. So I'm going to do the same thing for these. So one is going to go right here, the Savannah. And then we're going to put another one right over here. And then the birch is going to go right here. And right here along with the spruce. Wait, 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 what you doing? Along with the spruce, which is going to go here and here, 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 and here. But we have another birch. So the birch could go there. So like I said, we're going to eventually like terraform this more and stuff and expand the tree farm and all of that. It's going to be connected to a path. And I think I wasn't going to do this originally, but I am going to go ahead and enclose this area with a fence just because I don't want like mobs walking in here or creepers coming in here and blowing everything up because that would be disastrous. Um, I think this is how we're going to leave it. And I like it a lot because I feel like where it's off to the side of the house, when you look over here, it's just going to look like a forest rather than being some weird building. So we're going to leave it like this for now. Once all of that's grown, we're going to start working on our bridge in the next episode. But I am going to go ahead and end it here. I hope you guys had fun watching. Let me know in the comments down below if there's anything you think I should add to my little um, tree farm. I think I am going to add a swing though because anybody that knows me knows I love tree swings. And we could just like add one right here and it could be like permanent, you know? A permanent swing so we're definitely gonna do that I think yep I've decided I made a man we are gonna put a swing right here and maybe like a little bench and stuff so that people could come like hang out by the trees even though I have no friends that are gonna come hang out on my world <laughs> tear <laughs> so anyway where was I going with this I'm just gonna go ahead and end it now hope you guys had fun watching and I'll see you guys next time bye